Hi everyone, this is Diane. I wanted to quickly share some items with you today that I uh, bought when I went to Michael's after work. Um, I hadn't gone to this Michael's since I think I when I went when I went to go get the after Christmas grab bags. I think that's the last time I went to this Michael's, and I haven't. I don't particularly go to this one because it's a little bit further from for me. I usually go to one that's maybe 10, 15 minutes away, whereas this one may be about 30 minutes when there is no traffic. If I get stuck in traffic, it takes me up to 45 minutes to get to this particular Michaels and it's just too far for me. But I know that uh, people were buying grab bags and this particular Michaels had a ton of them um, the last time that they had them and it's because it's a newer Michaels. So I guess people aren't aware of what they really, they're not really aware of what they really are. So I took a chance and drove out there today and sure enough, they had a bin filled with grab bags. But a lot of the stuff were like Easter baskets and they were like the Easter grass, Easter eggs, things that I really didn't need. So I felt around for something that I thought was uh, items that were not those particular items, non-Easter items. So let me go ahead and share with you. And a lot of the stuff that I got were more school related. So let me go ahead and start. So the first thing that I'm going to show you is this container of colored pencils and it's from Artist Loft and it's I think it's seven different colors and there's seven pencils of each color so there's seven white, seven orange, seven of the brown, seven of the black and so forth. So there's 70 well 10 different colors because there's 70 pieces. So this was in one of the grab bags. Then this I got two of these because I, I ended up buying four grab bags and this is another uh oh hold on things are falling okay so this is another thing that was in there and this is a container of oil paint it's a tub of oil paint and that has 24 pieces and there you can see the little tubes in there so I've never used oil paint before so I'm excited to use these um, this was also in one of the grab bags I just started putting them all together so I ended up with two of them so 48 little tubes of oil paint and I like the containers then there is these box of flashcards and I took them out so this one is it says uh, shapes and colors so so there are the shapes and then it goes like to the different colors and let me turn it this way so you guys can see um, different colors and shapes and I figured I could cut these out and add them on cards or layouts so it's these and I guess these are blank and then some more and then these are all just different colors so and now again think remember I got four different grab bags so I just put them all together so it just makes it easier for me to share with you guys and as opposed to opening it up and trying to see what's in there I just went ahead and put them all together so amongst the four of them I ended up getting all of these flashcards um, these are also shapes and colors um, this one's pictures pictures and words and then these are completely blank so I have these as well so it's these have 45 pieces this has 50 this has 58 and this has 45 so that's a lot of flashcards um, two packs of highlighters highlighters are always handy then I got a three of these um, so you have the binder clips and the regular paper clips and then the thumbtacks and the blues and the pinks so and I think I have another one but it's in gray so I ended up having four of these which uh, that's a lot of a lot of paper clips I don't think I need that many paper clips so that then um, these are hall passes so it's the boys pass and it's the girls pass which they're cute but what I like about it is that they're magnetic I don't understand why they are magnetic I guess so that people so teachers can put them on the whiteboard because whiteboards are magnetic but I don't know but I like it because I can cut it and I can put my spell binders on there because I did need magnets so this is going to work perfectly so I have this one this one and this one 
So I have six long strips of magnets that I can cut for my spell binders and put them and put and get those organized in the binder so that I can put all of them together instead of having them in its original container. So I have those. And then I have like these name tags, a lot of teacher stuff, um, award badges, star students, today's your birthday ribbon. Um, I believe in books, bookmarks, and these are cute to cut out, the clouds or the bees. And then an incentive chart as well with different beads around it. So all of these came in the grab bags. And then all of these stamps as well. So let me start with this one. Let me try to get closer so you guys can see. Hold on, let me move you over a little bit. So again, I uh, I got two of these and I already have one. So I'm going to be putting these in a giveaway. Um, this one I have. I have these as well, um, and I think that's it. I don't have any more that I already have, but this one I do not have, and I'm keeping these, of course. got this one. i put it closer so you all can see this one here. Um, this one's, yeah, it's your birthday, or yay. It's, it's like, yeah, it doesn't say yay. It's your birthday. I love this one. See the little birdie right there? This is so pretty. Um, it's the boy, I guess, for future, I don't know, baby shower showers or people that just had babies. Springtime. Actually, I have this one. This one goes on this deck. And strawberries. Hope your day is perfect. And straight from heaven. This one I may have, but I'm not sure. So I'm not going to put that in that stack because I don't know about that one. Then I got these $2. These were $0.75. Cents. Instead of $1.50, they were $0.75. Cents. And I love this one. Do um, do what you love and do it often. And you can see it's already blue because I created these cards, these little cards. And uh, I use the stamp, so that's that's what it looks like when it's stamped out. I love that little stamp. And that was 75 cents. And then it has these little borders, the heart, and then like the bubbles. And then this one says, uh, say what? And uh, it has like a um, dialogue bubble. And then this one says woohoo right there. So I am a little drained today. It's Friday. It's almost 2 o'clock in the morning. And I am going to be going to bed as soon as I upload this video. Oh, and the last thing I got. I was so excited because, again, it was... It's a new Michaels. I rarely go to. I've only been to it two times. It's a little bit smaller than the Michaels I normally shop at, but I rarely go to it. But this is what I'm most excited about. I got a smash book in purple. The purple one. I am so, so excited. I'm just going to flip through the pages. I kind of go like the opposite direction. I'm going kind of like backwards. But I love this one. I love this purple smash book and I have been looking for it. So I got this purple smash book and I paid originally it was $12.99. I got it for $3.49. I was so excited because it was the new Michaels and I couldn't find them. And, and the recollections ones, those were on sale as well. But when I got it, it, I noticed it was a small three ring binder. And I'm like, I can so easily make this. I don't need to be spending four. It, those were $4.99. And I was just about to leave because it was, it was, I did not want to take a long time. I hadn't been home at all. And I'm like, I just need to hurry up and come in here quickly. But when I turned the corner, these were in a clearance rack and they were $3.49. I got this one. And I got the like the baby blue one. This is called Retro Style. And this one was $3.99 from $12.99. So I don't mind paying $3.99 either. And these are the pages in there. Just going go through it quickly. So I was so excited when I found them. So there were, I did get four of them. I got two two purple and two blue. So I am fine with my smash books because I do want to start working with these. As a matter of fact, I 
think I'm going to start working on one for my sister because I'm going to be going to Texas in the first or second week of, uh, of June. And I want to have one for my sister. And I may make one for my hubby as well for his birthday. So anyway, guys, that's it. That's my a haul for today. And I do need to not be shopping anymore. I really... I really need to stop, but I can't help it when when I find things that are so inexpensive. Like it's really hard for me to pass them up. But I guess if I didn't go to these stores, I wouldn't come across these deals, and I wouldn't have to spend. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I am going to upload this video and hit this hit the bed because it's two o'clock in the morning, and it was a long day today. So anyway, thank you so much for watching, and um, I will see what I what damage I create this weekend. Hopefully, I won't do any more shopping and um okay that's it guys thank you so much for watching and keep an eye out for my next video we'll talk soon bye